The International Monetary Fund has lauded the economic growth registered by Asian economies, but warns that in order to sustain growth, Asian nations will have to build domestic consumption rather than only depending on exports. Let's hear what Dominic Strauss-Kahn, the MD of IMF, had to say in an exclusive interview with NDTV Profits Ashutosh Sena in South Korea. Uh, most growth in Asia has been built uh, on uh, exports. And it's not going to work anymore. Well, no, it's wrong. It's going to work, but not enough. Uh, because of uh, the slowdown in the Western economies, the export to the Western economy will not increase enough to make the export model uh, stronger, to be strong enough to be sufficient. So it's absolutely necessary for uh, Asian countries to build a second engine of growth, which is based on domestic consumption or investment, depending upon the countries. Some have more to do in consumption, others on investment, which means building a social safety net, increasing access to credit by household and SMEs, also for easing investment and foreign investment, also building more infrastructures. All this is a shift from a more export-led growth model to a more domestic-led growth model. And that's probably the big strategy for uh, Asian countries. One of the big contentious issues, Dr. Khan, has been the issue of financial regulation. You know, the, the Asian model is seen as more resilient to whatever the crisis that happened, and the Western model is perceived as something that probably broke down in the crisis that happened in the next two years. How will that entire contentious issue be resolved among the developing and the developed nations? Well, the, the, the Asian financial sector is very sound and was very resilient to the crisis. And... Uh, I'm sorry to say, but part of this comes from the fact that uh, the IMF program uh, 10 years ago was certainly uh, harsh, difficult, too painful, could have been done with uh, less pain, but succeeded in the cleansing of uh, the financial sector. And that's one of the reason why in all these countries, this crisis then went through the, without too many problems. Uh, at the same time, the American system and the Europeans uh, had a lot of uh, bad uh, um, claims in the, in, the, in the balance sheet, and so a new kind of regulation is certainly needed there. Is it needed too in Asia? I will answer yes, because you, you were immune to this crisis. It doesn't mean that the Asian country will be immune to any financial crisis ever.